to talk a little bit about philosophy of tuning. This is one of the most asked about subjects I get. I'd say the biggest thing about it is that the ability to adapt quickly and imperceptibly. So that, you know, you're adapting like a string player would. So the first thing, hit on the knee and then pull up to this bone right next to the ear. So you want to do that quickly when you're tuning. Knee to the ear, boom, and then down to the drum. Now, what I said before, I'm going to talk about the philosophy of tuning, is that you try to get as close as possible. It is not going to be absolutely perfect sometimes because there's a whole science behind how these things sound. These overtones that confuse timpanists and percussionists and everybody else, they are really dissonant, which is different from string instruments, from brass instruments, from woodwinds, where all their overtones support the fundamental. I'll do this stuff, again, messing with the gauges, like they're not all in the right place. I'll get the C and G, here's the A. So there's the C, around there, get your G. Okay, this G is like a bit above the actual G. This C is a little bit below where the C gauge is. So now I get the F and B flat. That F is a bit above where the F gauge is. It's sort of in the middle, the A and B. 